Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Tony Stewart's All American Racing. Today, we have a very quick video. I want to show you that if we go into Quick Race, we have coming out on Friday for 10 bucks the late model DLC for this game. And I've got to say, out of all the cars, it is my favorite one to drive now in the game. It, they're, they're fast, they're insane, uh, and they're exactly what we've been looking for. So uh, let's start at the top, and I'll show you what we have here. We have me, we have Jack Carter, Ty Morgan, Amanda Parker, Jimmy Reynolds, Tiffany Rogers. We've got Casey Smith, and then we jump into the Tony Stewart's, and then we have Samantha Thompson, Austin Williamson, and Eddie Wright. Let's go with the uh, Tony Stewart's Mobile One scheme. It looks amazing. I do like the Pegasus there. And uh, we're going to go to Millstone Park Speedway. I'm going to go ahead and turn the difficulty down because, man, they have been kicking my butt. I'm going to go to AI difficulty of normal because I had them on expert. And uh, with these cars, man, they just absolutely destroy me. So I am going to roll with that. Go to Millstone Park and uh, I'll show you what these are all about. Under car setups, I'm going to go one tick to the right. So 60% loose. I'm going to select that setup. And uh, we're going to go into practice just so I can show you the car a little bit. Uh, I'm using a controller, Xbox One controller today. So I can show you how much fun these things are to drive with a controller. And you're just going to notice immediately the speed in these things, man. They're absolutely quick. And they're just so much fun to drive. So much fun to drive. Uh, the sounds are just about on par with the others. Not great by any means. Uh, we know that that is a weak point in this game is the sounds. Uh, but the feeling of these cars. So I know what you're going to ask me. How do these stack up to the late models that we saw in the NASCAR Heat games? And these drive nothing like those. These seem like we're absolutely on fire on top of the track instead of just kind of digging in there and going slow. Um, it, they just they, they drive nothing like them, as I put it into the wall. Uh, they drive nothing like it, and uh, they're their own animal. All right, we're not going to qualify. We're just going to go ahead and jump into Heat 4 and get racing so you can see how these things look out on the track. And uh, that's the number one thing that I have noticed is that they're just fast, purely speed compared to the other ones and it uh it, it's a nice holdover you know uh until we get sprint cars if we ever do get sprint cars i don't know um but they've got the speed and the fun factor of driving a sprint car like a 410 or something so oh careful careful there get our leaderboard out here so we're working now on position four as i get into the 44 car sorry about that buddy i'm not very good at controller but I just wanted to make a quick video and let you guys know this is coming out on Friday. For those of you that are fans of dirt track racing, and I know a lot of people have been looking forward to the late models being released. All right, into the corner. Working on the 28 car now, Jimmy Reynolds. I get a nice run on him here on the back stretch. Just might. Ooh, put the back right rear into him just a little bit. There we go. All right, now we're starting to run away from a, a little bit more. And one thing I've noticed is you really do have to play with the throttle in these cars. Um, I, I know I've shown you that before in this game, but with the late models, I've spun these things out so much by just kind of running wide open into a corner and not letting off and letting the car, you know, naturally want to rotate. Uh, you'll just spin it out completely. So keep that in mind. Yeah, like that. We just completely spun the car because... Oh, and we got arrow damage and caution flies. And that was because I just got a little too cocky, got into the corner, uh, a little too much throttle there. So that is a thing with these cars. Keep in mind, you don't want to just go, you know, full out into a corner and expect it to stay. It won't. All right, green flag in the air. Here we go. Racing once again. I get my, uh, whoop, my rear view mirror up here so you can see. There we go. Whoa, man, I tend to oversteer the car off the corner so much, and then I pay for it by, you know, pointing the nose towards the wall, which I don't mean to do. And another thing, since the last time we played this game, they did fix the... Oh, got in the wall, but we win the <laughs> We win the race? We win the race. Um, but they fixed the high line. So now the high line, you can absolutely use and uh, in pass. All right, into the qualified dash. Let's see how this works out for us. Determine the A main starting position and a uh, fewer cars. Let's try to clean our racing up here a little bit. I'm gonna try to do that. I'm gonna show you the other views. We got the nose view here. Whoa, man, I'm got a little got a little wild there in the beginning of that of that start. Okay. Too much, too much throttle, too much throttle. There we go. Gotta go a little bit less throttle than that. There we go. Then you have the inside view here, which is really nice. 
Whoa, 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 whoa. Using a little bit of break into the corner, too. Uh, that's helping me out. But these things have got so much power under the hood that you've got to kind of restrain yourself from, you know, going insane on these things. You really do. There we go. Getting better at it now. And I found that, uh, you know, if I'm not turning the wheel to the left more we're, we're gonna and just let it kind of naturally turn, well, screwed that corner up. But as you can see, whoa, hello there, buddy. Oh, he got into me and I got into the wall. No problem there. There we go. Now we got to try to catch back up to that guy. There we go. Now I'm getting warmed up on the controller. All right. 15. Finally clear him. Oh, a little bit of a slob job there on him, and we take the win from him. <laughs> All right, time for the A main. Let's get going. Try to win this thing, shall we? Make Tony Stewart proud, right? <laughs> Since we're in his car. All right, let's go ahead and uh, skip that. And try to drive smart here. Green flag in the air. Just those two gears, man. Oh, man. All right. Nice and smooth. There we go. I got to be smoother on the wheel and with my throttle input here. If we want to dominate this race. So on normal mode, maybe I'm a little fast for them. Maybe I should bump it up to hard, but that's okay. There we go. You see the car just, if you just leave the wheel in a, kind of a neutral position, it wants to naturally turn uh, to the right. So that's a good way uh, to get to the corner there instead of, you know, the back and forth motion on the controller, which I'm just, you know, not the greatest controller driver in the world. But we're making it happen here, and we're actually destroying them. So I think we have this one in the bag if we don't screw it up. Oh, we screwed it up. We spun the car into the corner, got a little too... Oh, when the caution comes out. Man, that's the biggest thing is that you're going to have to worry about your throttle input. I just, I don't know. I got the wrong angle and gave it too much gas and she spun right on around. So rookie mistake from the leader like an idiot. There we go. Good, good restart there. We have 22 laps to go. Got a slide job and another one working on us here. Okay, so now they got some uh, speed in the, towards the end of this race. I don't know where that came from, but they, they surely found some speed, didn't they? Yes, they did. Jack Carter on the uh, outside of us there. All right, let's try to just use that outside lane to our, to our advantage since he's down low. As you can see, we can actually make passes on the outside, and I love that we can do that now. Sorry there, buddy. Got into him a little bit. That was my fault. Oh, man, I went super low on that one. But it worked out. Ooh, again, oversteering. Don't want to do that. Let the car naturally want to turn with the throttle. Put up on some lappers here. I love how the body panels flap in the wind and all that mud and dirt just gets caked all over the car. It looks so cool. Really nice indeed. Yeah, we kind of walked away from the uh, 103 car and now we're working on these lappers here. 12 laps to go. And the caution flies for somebody back here in the back. And uh, that's going to give Jack Carter an option to catch up now, even though we were going through all that uh, lap traffic. So let's see if he can do something here at the end. Look at his car completely covered in mud, and he totally missed the shift on that restart. I'm sure we'll get asked, uh, can we run the late models in career mode? And that is a yes, you sure can. Uh, I will have my buddy Red, his uh, YouTube channel linked in the description below. You can go over there. Tomorrow he's putting a video out on exactly how to do that in career mode. So you can check it out over there. I'm just being smart here in traffic, trying not to get in an accident or something stupid. One lap to go, and uh, we're going to have this one in the bag, man. But, yeah, after driving this thing as much as I have so far, I can 100% tell you it's all throttle control, which you would not expect, you know, being an arcade racer, as I put it into the wall right there, getting around that car, we still get the win. Uh, you wouldn't expect it, but that is the case. It is 100% throttle control. And the final results, we win the race. We win the uh, the A main and uh, so on and so forth. So, uh, yeah, I could jump them up just a little bit more. I think we kind of uh, dominated them just a tad in that one. Well, there you have it, folks. You can get the late models on Friday for $9.99 as a DLC. And uh, be sure to check out Red's video that comes out tomorrow. I'll see you next time. Take care. Hey, guys, Jeff here. Just to let you know real fast that the uh, merch is still available. You can check out the links below to go check it out. We have new Halloweens coming. 
down the line. Thank you guys so much for the support. I really do appreciate it.